guys, it's me, Kanda, and today we're doing another Sun and Moon uh, Pokemon information type video, and we're going to be talking about a recently new Pokemon that has been uh, added to the Sun and Moon list, uh, and it's called Sandit, Sandalit, San Sal Sal Salamit, I could be wrong, it sort of looks like a salamander, um, it is apparently the new, po it is a poisonous Pokemon is uh, uh, the new sort of new poison type. It, it's not just a poison type. It's actually a dual type. It's a poison fire type, as you can see. Um, you see, it's a poison fire type, which is actually kind of cool. Um, that's a cool uh, pairing right there, and it looks like a really really cool Pokemon. It looks sort of, I guess, salamander is what's supposed to be. Um, I don't know what that's supposed to be. Its head. It looks kind of creepy, but. I do admit, I like its body. I like the little fire right there and the little sort of hand print or something. Like it's, it's like uh like you know if you guys have ever seen a like the inside of a volcano like descriptions of inside of a volcano what has like those pockets or whatever. Kind of looks like that and it's going out in its tail. That looks really cool. Um, it has the ability, conrigion, conrigion, uh, con, something, um. It's a uh, sand sandalit, sandal sandalit, sandalit, uh, emits toxic gas gathered with flames from the base of its tail. This uh, poisonous gas has a sweet smell, and everyone unknowingly breathes it in and becomes dizzy. Sandalit is known as a very powerful Pokemon. Oh, it, it's even powerful. That's cool. Um, but it, uh, its cunning nature allows it to battle fiercely through... Throwing the opponent off balance, sandalit, fem sandalit females not only release toxic gas, but they can also emit pheromones to attract males of other species, uh, including Pokemon and humans. Inhaling this pheromone can cause opponents to be controlled by sandalit will. Okay, maybe, maybe I should, maybe I was thinking about catching this Pokemon when Sun and Moon came out. I don't think so now. That is quite the creepy uh, Pokedex injury or whatever. Description of it. Sandal has the corrosion, corrosion, corrosion ability. It's a new ability. Corrosion ability has it uh, becomes uh, impossible to afflict poison status. Even uh, it's impossible to afflict poison status, poison status conditions even on steel and poisonous Pokemon. So that's um, kind of cool. Um, Besides the controlling you at will, uh, it's actually a pretty cool Pokemon. Um, there's its ability. Uh, it can hit basically its move can allow you to hit any basically any type, even steel type, which um, is kind of cool. I didn't know you could. I thought you could already even poison steel types too. Maybe I was wrong. Um, but yeah, there is is poisoning a um, Skarmory. A Skarmory. Um, there it is, the koala Pokemon, um, hitting it with flame, there's Ruff Ruff, hitting it with a poison type, uh, rock, um, but yeah, that was the new, uh, Pokemon for Sun and Moon. I know this is a pretty short video, and I'm really sorry about that, um, but I really wanted to talk about it, because it's kind of an old, it's kind of a cool looking Pokemon. I really like it, um, I definitely really think I'm gonna catch it, I don't know if I'm gonna use it in a battle, to battle. uh, I haven't, I have to uh, see how it plays how I prefer to see when I, when I play it, how, how I feel about it when I play it, uh, play with it. Um, yeah, I kind of like its description. I like how it's able to hit any, how it's basically allowed to poison almost any type of Pokemon. Um, I think it's going to be really super effective against a lot of the fairy types, um, that we see here, because we, if you think about it, a lot of Pokemon that we've seen, uh, some of the Pokemon we've seen, um, our fairy types, so I think this would be kind of cool, a cool new poison type to add to against fairy types. So, um, but yeah, I really like it. I think it's a, uh, cool, it's a cool looking Pokemon. Um, yeah, um, that, that's pretty much it, uh, about it. That's, there's only one new Pokemon. There's also something else that I want to mention that I didn't mention in my last video, but that was a new, apparently there's supposed to be a new feature sub- to be a new feature. I don't know if this is actually going to happen, 
but we might be able to ride Pokemon, certain Pokemon, or at least, um, uh, uh, Herdier, or how, Herdier, I think it is, uh, it's the final evolution of Lillipop, uh, no, Stoutland, Stoutland is the evolved form, Stoutland, we're able to ride Stoutland, um, now I don't know if it's only going to be that, or if it's going to be, uh, cause there are a couple of other Pokemon that you can, that are rideable, like, um, a Ponyta, uh, a Rabidash, um, uh, Arcanine, uh, I want to see, I'm curious if we'll be able to ride any other Pokemon, too, or if it's just going to be Stoutland. I would really like to be able to ride a variety of Pokemon, but I know it's not going to be every Pokemon, I know it's probably going to be, like, a Pacific Pokemon, and maybe certain Pokemon can only go on certain types of terrain, like, you know, if you're in more of a rocky, mountainous area type of uh, of the Alola region, you can use a certain Pokemon for that. Or if you're more of a field, in a field you can use another type of Pokemon. But that is actually a pretty cool feature if it turns out to be true. I have no idea because um, this hasn't officially been confirmed. There's only been images of it, of your character, the male character, writing it. So I don't know if that's going to be true or not, but I kind of hope it is because, I mean, that's kind of a cool feature compared... It's sort of like an update to the whole right, uh, uh, right on, not right on, what is it right on? Right on, um, being able to ride right on in, uh, X and Y, it's kind of like an update of that, which was a cool feature too, being able to ride that Pokemon, and, you know, now being able to ride basically almost any Pokemon, um, in the Pokemon game, so, if it does, I hope it actually does come true, because, it's a pretty cool feature, and I can't wait to see it in uh, action. So yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it's maybe kind of smaller than most of my other cinnamon videos. That's because there's not really a lot to talk about. I only want to talk about that new Pokemon and a new feature that is supposed to happen. I don't know if it is, though. So yeah, I hope you guys really enjoyed this uh, video. Um, so yeah, um, I'm Canada, and I guess goodbye until next time. Yeah.